Hey guys, so I am back with a brand new video and you guys, I missed you so much here on my beauty channel. I have not filmed in almost like over two months on this channel. Um, but if you guys don't know, I had my son on April 8th and he is amazing. Um, if you watch my vlog, then you already know that. But if not, then yes, I already had my son and I'm back. Um, I just pretty much just took those like, it's, uh, it's going to be two months soon, but I just took those two months to just kind of like focus on mommy life, spend my time with him, get to know him and just kind of like enjoy this time before I go back to work in July. But I kind of figured, you know, it's been two months. So it's time to get back to filming my videos here on my beauty channel, which I'm super excited about. I did do some shopping at Marshalls and Burlington because you guys know, you know, you can find some hidden gems as far as like makeup pretty much anywhere you just have to kind of like look and be willing to try the products out so i kind of figured let me go to marshall's let's kind of like raid their beauty section and i found some pretty good stuff and also at burlington co factory as well so i kind of figured i'll just put the products into a haul and of course put it to the test in an upcoming like makeup video um and i also got a few things from walmart and target as well which i'll feature towards the end of the video so yes, if you guys want to see what I picked up, and of course, just keep watching. So starting off, the first product that I have is by Profusion. It's their Studio Contour Palette, and I think the packaging is so cute. You do get three contour shades on the bottom, and then on the top row, you do get like one shimmer highlight, and then you also get two matte highlighters here as well. So I figured since I do have their blush palette, which is this one, so I already own this blush palette, which I really, really, really like. I kind of figured I would give their contour palette a try. So can I have to try it out? And of course, I would definitely keep you guys posted in an upcoming video um, once we do that makeup video. So then the next product I actually tried out in advance because I do have a other highlighter to try out. Um, but I did use this one today. This one is by Bella Pierre Cosmetics. It's their glowing palette. And you do get six shades in here. So here is the packaging. I think it's really sleek, really cute. And then on the back, it pretty much just shows you the different shades and of course the names of the product as well. And then you do get a mirror in the inside and here is the shadows. So really cute. And I just kind of go through the names really quickly. So then the first one is what I actually have on today. That one is called Guilt. And then you have Amores, which is right here. And then you have Beam. And then you have Moonstone, Stellar, and uh, Glimmer. And I did use the Gilt because I thought it was, you know, a really pretty color. So I do have it on, but I have the Carly by Bell highlighter topped on top of it. Um, but I do think it's a really pretty palette. And I did swatch it on my hand for you guys. Here is the swatch right here. I do think it's really pigmented and really pretty. So super excited about that um now these other colors i probably won't get any use out of these four right here but definitely these two i can definitely play with um so yeah i do like this one and the next highlighter palette it's by jasmine labelle cosmetics it's their glow and illuminate perfecting set um you do get four highlighter compacts in here and of course you get a brush in the middle to use and i do think these are really 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 pretty and then the back of the packaging is so so gorgeous you guys like so freaking gorgeous so cannot wait to try this and then the next item that i have it's by max studio is their 23 piece full face kit um you do get two eyeshadow quads and then you also get two blushes you get a brush you get a lip liner lip crayon lipstick mascara eyeliner and a brow liner as well so i think for beginners this might be a really cute little kit to play with but i'll definitely try it out to let you guys know um but it only costs $7.99 so i think to get a full not a full face but as far as like the essentials for a full face you definitely can't beat it for $7.99 and then the last item actually not the last item but the last like eyeshadow item is by mac studio is the pro shadow collection and i thought this was really cute you do get 20 eyeshadows in here and the packaging remind me of like morphe or like bh cosmetics but you do get some matte shadows and some shimmer shades in here as well this only costs 5.99 for 20 shadows so hopefully the shadows are really good because that would definitely be a steal like for real for real and then I picked up um, some matte lip glosses. Um, this is by Jackie and Lauren. Is their matte lip gloss, and I actually have on one of the colors today. But here is the six 
matte lip glosses right here so you do get a nice array of like you do get a nice array of like mauves in here, which you guys so I definitely like my, my, my mauves. Um, and then one of that I actually have on is this one right here on my lips. I think it's a really pretty color. Um, only thing is, you know, it did start to separate on me. So I don't think it's the best that's out there because again, it started to separate on me, but I do think it's a really pretty color. Um, I do have some swatches on my hand for you guys. So these are the colors swatched on my hand and as you can see they're pretty much like they're dry like they're not going anywhere so yeah they're definitely matte um but i don't think they have a glossy finish at all so but they're still really pretty colors um moving on by orly i did get this like nail polish set it's pretty much like a nail polish and like a seal coat to like lock the color in place which i thought was really cool because you know if it really works then I could have my nail polish on for like a whole week but this is what it looks like and I mean it doesn't claim to be on for like a week or like last a week but in my opinion gel polishes typically last two weeks tops but for it to be this little like mini set I kind of figured you know if it could last me a week that'll be amazing if not then oh well too bad but this is what it looks like and you get some pretty colors as well and then I also picked up some mascara. This one is by W7, it's their Absolute Lashes Mascara. So I kind of figured that I have a mascara for the tutorial. So we do have a mascara. And then I picked up three sheet masks. Um, one is, actually two is by Tony Molly. This is the Brightening Mask, it's the Lemon Sheet Mask. And then we have the Aloe Moisturizing Sheet Mask. And then my Alba Botanica, we have the Coconut Water Hydrate Sheet Mask. And you guys know I have dry skin, so I kind of figured I would get the ones that's like moisturizing, hydrating, and of course, because it's summertime, gotta have the skin, you know, popping and brightening and glowing. So hopefully I like these. I do have some sheet masks from like Sephora, but you know, kind of figured I'd give these a try as well. Then I also have some lashes. Um, everything else is pretty much from like Target and uh, Walmart besides this one item is from uh, Marshalls. But I found these Ardell Flawless Lashes, which I thought was really cool because I have never seen these before at all in the drugstore. Um, these are tapered luxe lashes and it says it's premium Remy hair. So hopefully these work out really well because I do think they look gorgeous. They're very wispy and long and yeah definitely excited about these and then everything else is pretty much from again target or walmart so i picked up two lashes from kiss um this one is called posh and then the other one is called shy um shy is more like your natural look and then posh is more of like that full volume volume look so yeah i got some lashes that I also picked up two concealers. Um, one is by Hard Candy. I told you guys I tried this one out before, but it was very like oily when I would squeeze it out the tube, and it did not, mm -mm, did not like that. So I picked up another one because I really am hoping that one was a dud. Um, and then the other one is by Wet n Wild. It's their new concealer. So hopefully I like this one also. Then I also picked up a highlighter from Essence. It's the Pure Nude Highlighter and I have heard really good things about it. It's called Be My Highlight and definitely can't wait to wear this one and I have it swatched on my hand right here for you guys. But yeah, you guys, that's pretty much everything I picked up. Um, I did just a repurchase of the cat suit by Wet n Wild um, in the color Give Me Mocha in Rubble Rose, which you guys have seen before on my channel. But I just got these again. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed my video. And again, I miss you guys. I am vlogging, so make sure you guys check out my vlogging channel. I have it in my description box as well as all my social media accounts. Um, so you guys can stay updated with me and just kind of see what I am doing and all that good stuff but I'm super excited make sure you guys subscribe like always and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys